You're the third emperor of Rome whom I've served. Parthenians are besieging our legions, and there's a heavy winter coming. You better hope, Emperor, that the power of Rome rests not in the hands of your appointed generals, but in the hearts of those anonymous soldiers who make up your legions. The Scythians have cut off our supply. We have provisions for only two more days. If the enemy doesn't kill us, then the lack of food or the cold will. You called for me, sir. You've been selected to deliver a message to General Cabello. Through the ravine. <laughs> For no man's land, wilderness, a muck with cutthroats and Dardinian <laughs> assassins. I never imagined my greatest political foe would be my only hope for survival. What you ask of me is impossible. Then you what could succeed? It's you. Oh, may the gods protect you. Go out from here and run as if Hades himself would pursue me. When you're a Roman soldier, you get used to your hardships. And what doesn't kill you only makes you stronger. He's making his way to Corbulo. That route is impossible. Nothing is impossible if you have the will to survive. His men are starving. His mercenaries are deserting. The enemies of Rome surrounded him. Why hasn't he sent for me? For help? They're all already dead, Marcus. between hunter and prey when they both know it must end. The troops must be ready to march at dawn. Show me, Roman! Here! 